a string of shootings that left one man dead and two others injured. The first two shootings happened in Kansas City. The deadly shooting happened in Grandview, and that's where we find KMBC 9's Dennis Evans. And Dennis, these shootings had many neighbors afraid to leave their homes. Yes, they definitely were. I spoke with them this morning. Now, all of this started with the call of three different shootings. Two of those, as you said, in Kansas City, one in Grandview. It was at this park right here where a camera captured an image of the suspect. It was a green pickup truck that they believe was involved in all of the shootings. Now, it all started at 8 o'clock in the morning. That is when the first call came in. Near Ruskin and Sycamore Terrace, less than 10 minutes later, another call. This one to Longview and Food Lane. Shortly after that, a third call came in. This time, a fatal shooting in Grandview. Grandview with the same green truck involved. Police found that truck and captured the suspect at about 1130 this morning, but not before he took one life and left one resident and left residents fearing for their safety and wondering what in the world happened. It could have happened to anyone, but it's just sad. You know, people really aren't even safe anymore. No telling what the guy who did it, what he was going through his day, but these people didn't deserve that. Not today, they didn't. Nobody deserves to be I don't want to say the words, you know, gun down like this, but this is very tragic. Now, before the suspect was taken into custody, neighbors in this area were afraid to go outside. Many didn't want to let their children go outside because they just didn't know what happened. They say that the young man who was shot and killed in Grandview was in his 20s. He was supposed to be starting his first day at a new job, and they said they have no reason whatsoever to believe, as neighbors do, that he had any interaction whatsoever with the suspect. And they said that is the most scary part to them, that this, they believe, was a random shooting. In Grandview, Dennis Evans, KBC 9 News.